All right, and following the earthquake yesterday, some faculty at CSUB evacuated their offices, fearing their building wasn't safe. They were told it was safe to go back inside, but after a memo released this morning, some aren't so sure. 23 ABC's Jessica Harrington joins us now and has the memo that put some faculty members on edge. Jessica? Jackie, faculty today say they're still shaken up from the earthquake, but now some are even more uneasy after this memo was hand delivered to them this morning. It says that the faculty towers building is seismically deficient, but still safe to work in. I'm nervous about working in the building, and I'm not the only one. One faculty member didn't want to be identified on camera, but says she and others are worried after learning their building is seismically deficient. Anytime something moves or you hear a loud noise, it's like, is that an earthquake? In the memo today, the vice president of facilities management says immediately after the earthquake, he went to look at the building for damage. He says there was no damage, but he still consulted with experts to ensure the building's safety. The building is built in accordance to the seismic and building codes that were in effect in the 1970s and is just as safe as any other building in Bakersfield built at that same time period. He says the building meets all of the state's seismic and building codes, but it's classified as seismically deficient by a CSU self-established seismic committee made up of experts in the field of architecture and engineering. The CSU, because of the number of students and people that come and go from our campuses, are desiring to develop a standard that far exceeds the state's mandates relative to building codes. And the chief of police says everyone was told it was safe to go back inside because there were no signs that it was unsafe to re-enter. At that point, we had no indications of any type of damage. We didn't have any indications of anything falling off the shelves. We had no indications of any injuries. So therefore, it, was not, it did not raise to the standard that we would evacuate the buildings. The faculty member says it makes her feel better knowing the building was inspected, but she says she's still not completely convinced. You want to come to work, you want to do your job, but it would be nice to be very comfortable and know that, that we're... And the CSU system has given Cal State Bakersfield money to build a new building for faculty. That project is underway and is scheduled to be completed in fall of 2017. Reporting live in Southwest Bakersfield, Jessica Harrington, 23 ABC.